Hello, all of my beautiful beans and things. We are back with Xenoblade Chronicles. This is actually part two of a stream because Kathy couldn't leave it there. Absolutely not. There was too much insanity going on and I needed more answers. I was invested. Anyways, with that in mind, let's jump right back into the insanity. I'm just gonna eat a spoonful of peanut butter hair while I think about my life and the choices have led up to this moment and me subjecting myself to this. I think I processed what has happened. Did some self-therapy there and... All right, let's move on. I I can't leave it there. Let's, let's go with this party. Oh, teleporter, okay. I'm... Pretty sure we have to go elsewhere, but I'm not certain. Flashbacks from Metro Dread, where it's like, ah, you've defeated Raven Vic. Good job. Ah, you've defeated, you know, this run for your life. Uh, not quite as dramatic as that, but. Any, like, thing. Ah! Right, there is, uh, I had auto run on. That was a bad idea. Let's not run off of this again. I am terrified to see how the Bionis has changed. Like, this is not going to be the same Bionis we left. This music is just not helping the stress levels. I mean, they were like way up here and then they went like down and they probably would have been down here. Ah. Something about the viewpoint just had bop it up. It's like, ah. it's just keeping at a vague level of just why. I'm not ready for another cutscene. I'm just not. All right. Let's go. Oh, wait. Can we still do... Wait, there is... I'm just confused. Did I lose the ability to go over here? Or can I... No. Because there was a quest, but I don't know if I can still do it. Use the... In the control tower. How did I... Can I still do that? Yeah, do it now. Okay. Thank you. Oh, wait, here? <gasps> oh, I see what this is. Uh, yeah, pray. I don't want to lose all of this. <gasps> You're brilliant. I love you. <laughs> we figured it out. We are not lost, Button. Oh, yes. I can still fight Temporal Grain. I can still do this quest. We are not locked out. I see why I got confused. Oh, hello there, good sir. I need to... Still a weapon. Uh, art from you. Weapon complete. What did I get? I need to know. War blades! I want war blades. Come here. Alright. Let's check out Warblades. They're not even as good as my Dystopia, which I got kind of by accident, but I mean, this is fine. Looks like it's all over. Yep, I know, even though I wasn't there. What's with that laugh? Mike Wall, I want to thank you for what you did for my son, but we have to escape here first. Yep. All right. Oh, I'm not ready. This 
game has already destroyed me today. Well, I will survive. I'm going to just assume. So desperate to cling to your pathetic life. Are you the same? Even when there is no hope for you. I I have no hope that anyone will survive. Don't you ever give up? That's the point we're trying to make. No, we don't. We don't give up. Never. But hear this, Zanza. They will judge me not in life, but death. Not even the Makonis survives. Shulk. <sighs> For both our worlds, you must succeed. Lady Maynard. I mean... What of the worlds kind of already got destroyed? Oh. <sighs> right? Remember when we thought they were the bad guys? Uh, I was literally just thinking, like, I was so ready to destroy them all. Thank you. Look, stop it. What's that cloud? You can't do this to me. You can't. You can't. What are... Are those? It's Telethia! That is! Yeah, Dino Beast! What did that matter? No! You're not getting away! Dixon! No. Listen, Hulk Hogan from Wish. Over. Time for you all to return to the Bionis. Nice and quietly. That's enough. Why, Dixon? What made you like this? Shulk looked up to you, respected you. Dixon, don't let Zanza control you. Wake up. <sighs> I mean, total control. I've always been like this. Ever since long before any of you lot were born. Before we were born? Now you yeah, get it. It's just like Eagle said. I'm Lord Zanza's disciple. Dixon of the Trinity! Of the Trinity. Okay. This was... This, uh... You know... This title you've given yourself was completely unnecessary, good sir. You already have one. Talk Hogan from Wish. This is... No. You've lost any right to a name. All right. Okay. Okay, come on. We're going to let this... Come on. Yeah. I can see why... There would be much regret. I'm waiting for this to... Okay. Let's do this. Come on. Ah, I missed it out on it a little bit. That's fine. Alright, we're doing okay. Let's go. Let's 
go. Ah! No, don't blow me off! Rude. Don't knock me off. Oh, they are discouraged. Oh, we're locked. Okay. What? What? Did I? Oh. Oh, no, it's just a cutscene. You waste of space. Not so tough without Shulk, eh? Stupid beast. No, no. You should be grateful. Not everyone has a war buddy like me to lead them along. Tasted good, didn't they? The victory drinks we used to share. I'll kill you! What? <sighs> Who was that? What? Show yourself! Melia, are you alright? Ah. Uh. Brother! Are you gonna die too? Kalyan. Dixon! He works for the Bionis! He shot Shulk in the back! Is this true? Dixon? This ends Then what about Alvis? Where is Alvis? What is no match for our Havres squadron? You cannot win. Maybe you should be concentrating on your own people instead of barking at me. <gasps> Looks like you've forgotten your destiny. Hmm? Right? Lorathea? Lorathea? Are you involved in this as well? Your Highness. Your naivety is quite charming, but it is also your undoing. <laughs> I had much fun playing with you and your father. What? What is this fight? How dare all of you? Ether particles emitted so that the Bionis can be destroyed and reborn. <laughs> what do you get if you cross high concentrations of ether with high entia? Bombs? No, you wouldn't! Lorothea! Awaken my darling oh. pets! Or more telethia? Do we have to murder her brother now? Lorothea! Let him go! You misunderstand, child. <laughs> this is the reason why High and Tear are born. Do not blame poor old me. Oh, is this Explain why they need, like, someone with like a certain says, DNA? The High and Tear are a race created by Lord Zanza to eliminate any annoying life forms in the preparation for the rebirth of the Bionis. Their bodies contain a gene that, when the time comes, transforms them into telethia. Is this why they were so focused on genetic code? It can't be. Say it isn't so. But is this the true for half Entia? That is why you are our only hope. Brother? Whatever. We won't be ah! Like Everything is coming together. This mean, writing is brilliant. I love it. Turn into a telethia. It just means you're going to get crushed by one. <laughs> That's the only Slap thing it. you're good for. <gasps> Rise up, pets. Do my bidding. Kill your lovely sister. Of the Trinity. Why is there a Trinity? Is she one of them? The Hyantia? Elvis and. Him? Brother! I'm wondering. Ah! Uh... I'll find a way to save you. M Melia. So sorry. I always placed such a heavy burden on you. Don't say such things, brother. But at least I can. Still shoulder the destiny of our people. The burden meant for you brings a tear to my eye. These moments are to be treasured. I am. <sighs> How?
Oh. Brother! Yes, fight against destiny. Father's wish and the future of the High Entia are in your hands. Yours and Shulk's. <gasps> Telethia, destroy him. Dixon! I got it. Too late. This is very bittersweet. Brother! Victory against at least. Poor Melia! She has lost her dad and her brother now? I wasn't planning on doing two chapters today. Where am I? Please tell me Alice is like a double agent here. So there is still a shock. Suddenly space. Oh. Uh, so I'm... No. But not. <laughs> okay, shock's lost it. What was I doing? What was the purpose of my life? You were trying to help people. That's it. Friends. No. I've got it wrong. I was never alive. But you are! You're you exist now! It was Sansa. Then All how along, do you exist? I everything I did was Do you want to say pointless? <laughs> That voice. <gasps> Nobody else can decide that. Only you. What exactly is happening? Don't actually tell me, but... <sighs> oh, we've just parked straight in a... Uh... Colony six. Shulk. Here, Mikol made you a wonderful new weapon. Since you lost your Monado, I mean. It uses the latest Machina technology. Use it when you wake up. Then, let's all go on living. We've relocated the Hyentia and the Nopon refugees to Colony 6. Thankfully, the Mekon did us a favor by fortifying it for us. It should hold out for a while. It's ironic. Mm. We want to escape Zanza, but we can't leave his body, the Bionis. Well, this is our home. Princess, I have to know. Should we be worried about the evacuated Hyentia? I cannot be sure, but I believe not. All those who survived are part homes like me. Understood. Mm. If they ever do transform, I will be among them. If that time comes, you know what to do. Are you sure? Everyone is obliged to accept their fate. No way. There's no way Callion would leave the fate of the Hyentia to you if that was going to happen. Precisely. Yeah, and he fought against his fate. We must fight Zanza and the Telethia. 
It may not be the case with all of them, but a large number of Telethia were once high Hyentia. Your subjects and your brethren. I am prepared for that. Even if it means harming my brethren, it is for the protection of the survivors. That is the final wish of my father and brother. I will fight. That's a hard choice, but free the soul stolen by Zanza. Yeah. She's she's making for the greater good. For all living life. How shook. He's going to make it. His wound has closed. I think Maynith used the last of her power to protect him. So he's okay. Linada is tending to him now. Fiora? He won't wake up. It's like his consciousness has sunk to the bottom of a cold, dark lake. I keep saying his name, but he doesn't respond. Sansa's gonna pay for this. What if the Telethia attack? Then we'll have to fight without Shulk. That's why we've strengthened our defenses. <sighs> that weapon I made should come in handy as well. We're backed into a corner, but we'll give it all we've got. Can your resistance yes. truly achieve anything? What do you mean by that, Alvis? Exactly what I said. We were all born of the Bionis, of Zanza. It is Zanza's will that the Telethia return us to the body from whence we came. Whether we die of old age or in battle, we all eventually return to the Bionis. We cannot escape this fate. Am I wrong? You've got it backwards, man. Just because he thinks it doesn't make it so. We decide whether to keep living or not. I agree. I mean... Even though he's our creator, that doesn't afford him the right to take our lives on a whim. But that is the thinking of a Homs. He is a god. Such morals cannot apply to gods. So you think we should just shut up and die? No. If that is the fate decided by a god. You are mistaken if you think we will simply accept such a fate and wait to die. We'll never stop fighting, not till the end. To Zanza, the outcome is the same. Thus, your logic is flawed. It ain't the outcome that's important. It's the will to fight back. Even if you die in vain. At least you tried. Whose side are you on? You scared or something? Frightened of a few Telethia? Stop <laughs> this. There's no point fighting amongst ourselves. Fiora. <sighs> Sorry. I need to go and get some air. Oh no. Your body okay? <sighs> hey there, Shulk. Oh, affinity charts updated. Very good. Shulk. Why do you... Lenata is looking. I must stop staring. Uh, hi. How are you? You really are worried about Shulk. He is still unconscious, but his condition is stable. All right. It's as if Lenata can see into my very heart. It is embarrassing. I not let's <laughs> not remain here any longer. Oh. Hi. How are you? I will shut down at midnight. Ah. So it must be at night. Okay. Oop. Hi. What is Nolanada doing? Is she resting? Shulk. Please wake up soon. How long do you want to sleep? You must get up. The world needs you. Oh, I need you. We all need you. Oh. Is there anything else or is it the same thing? Can you hear me? Maybe you're lost. Perhaps you feel helpless. But please stay with me a little longer. Oh. Since I first met you, is as if my life has been turned upside down. It has been an unending chain of anxiety, worry, and sadness. I have experienced much pain, father's death, losing my people. Just thinking about it, it is difficult to hold back the tears. I wanted to grieve for everything lost, but I did not because I still have hope in you. You have kept me strong. You, Sharla, Ricky, everyone. You have all stood by me and given me so much strength. I cannot even begin to put my gratitude into words. Oh. 
I do not think you have noticed. And of everyone you've given the most for me, it is even because of you that I feel the way I do now. But I've given you nothing in return. You get friendship. Shulk, what can I do for you? Oh. What was I trying to do? No, no. What? This is terrible. You'd be disappointed to see me like this. I should not be this way. Shulk is always honest with every- Is he? Is he really honest with everyone? Because he keeps things. Yeah, I figured. <laughs> but he kind of keeps things to himself and doesn't tell people when he's struggling. I must not understand that. If that is short strength, I must not take advantage of it. I must not succumb to it. I cannot stand equally with Shulk. I can only protect the happiness for which Shulk wishes. That is all. Next time, I will try to protect the people important to Shulk. Oh, hey! We improved Aaron. Affinity. <laughs> While Shulk is asleep. <laughs> Alright. I can't believe we're in chapter 17. I need to find out what happens. At least as far as this goes. Oh, hey! Oh, right! We're in colony 6. I was very confused there. I have to do this cutscene first. You okay there? Like, not just emotionally, but physically. Oh. You burn. You good boy. Fiora, are you alright? Guess I wasn't hiding it well. I didn't want to worry anyone. It must be difficult living with that body. I'm getting more and more used to it. But people still look at me funny. Oh, it's not that bad. It feels pretty comfortable, actually. I don't need to worry about food or anything like that. I see. But you're not sure how long it'll hold up. The energy from the chest component made it work. It turned out to be a monado. Such a strange feeling. A monado? Mm. Was that the monado that Zanza took from Maynith? Yeah. Did body ceased to function? Oh. Uh. fine for now. There's still some stored energy left. But then what? Uh, no! Don't do this to me. If I ever... Please take care of Shulk. Don't talk don't like that. Yeah, that's what I'm gonna say. Don't talk like that. How can you ask me such a thing? I... I'm sorry. There's no need to apologize. You're right. Thank you, Melia. If Shulk awakes, will you tell him? No. He worries too much anyway. <laughs> he does worry. Just like him. I need to hug a cat. I'm already dead. I have been since the Mechon attacked. Fiora. But I'm happy now. This body has given me the chance to live. <laughs> I mean, technically, I Shulk was also time. dead. Two zombies in love. <laughs> secret from the others you do not want them to worry I admire your strength maybe I'll tell him but only when the time is right I won't say a word oh, if we get it back we can we can help <laughs> right I'm nothing compared to her Amelia, we love you anyway. We love you. Oh no! A siren! Fiora, let's hurry back! 
Okay. No! I can't! I can't with this game! This game is going to just absolutely destroy me. <gasps> we just had like this emotional moment of like Fiora being coming to terms with her mortality. And then it's like, danger! Uh don't do this to me. Don't do this to me. Is it telethi attack? Please no. That siren. Is that? Telethia! The horde of them are approaching! Let's move! Gotcha! I'm going too! But Shulk needs you! I know! But I can't just stay here. What if something happened to you? What would I tell Shulk when he wakes up? Fiora, are you sure? <sighs> Nothing better happened to her. I cannot handle that again. Oh, you are terrible. Oh, don't be like that. You'll meet him soon enough. You might even be reborn if you return to Lord Zanza. Who knows? He might be your boyfriend next time. You will not mock the memory of my brother. You lot don't know when you're beaten. Why don't you just give up? Did you just kick it off? Uh. It's my decision. Oh my gosh. No, I need to know what happened. Perpetuate their uh. existence. Zanza and Mayneth must use a being they created as a physical host. They cannot exist forever as mere souls. This world was created so that they may continue to exist. It is for this reason that its existence and future is in their hands. This is the passage of fate and your visions. People live and die at the mercy of Zanza. And through this, Zanza maintains the existence of this world. Our destruction was always inevitable. Everything we did was meaningless. Are you certain? It was his will to revive you and use you as a host. Taking the Monado from Mayneth, doing with the world as he wishes. Everything was as he decided. That's why he said there were but two voices in his head, maybe. Now wishes to destroy you. What is the need for this? That's because... Become your own he person. In fact, has no choice but to do it. If he does not, he risks his entire existence. Because you can stand up to him. And we're the source of that risk. But why? It is a marvel to exist outside the passage of fate. The lives created by Zanza and Mayneth inevitably attempt to escape the passage of fate. This signifies the beginning of their destruction. Mayneth accepted this and entrusted the future of this world to you. Many times, your visions have allowed you to change the passage of fate. Okay. You saved the lives of those destined to die. I couldn't save everyone. Mm. Nothing that exists is perfect. It is a sad truth, but you can learn from it and begin the journey on a new path. Not Zanza's path, but one that you forge yourselves. Our own path. Our own Minato. So, decide, Shulk. 
Will you walk the path laid out by Zanza? Or will you walk Who are path? you? And why are you... Hmm. The Monado awaits you. What? That was always how it was going to be. If I'd wanted to walk the predetermined path, I wouldn't have come this far. Even with the odds stacked against us, even though I can't see the future, I'll keep walking. My own path, that I decide. Fiora, Rhine, Dunvan, Sharla, Melia, Ricky. We all feel the same. Well then, you must defy fate to succeed. Succeed and follow a new path. Alvis. Who are you? Are you? You already know. You know what I am. And what you must do. I have theories, but I'm not certain. These things don't give up. All right. Ricky never lose. Ricky protect Colony Six. Right. We can't let them get any further. You know the drill. Take them down. Oh yeah. Let's go. Man, there we go. Oh, nice. Come on. Oh, wait, I'm not attacking them. That would be why I was. Focused on another one. That's okay. We're fine. Let's go. Oh, bye. Okay. All right, we can uh, fight some Telethia now. I am glad to find a higher level of monster. Oh, does it? Ooh, nifty. Good job, Ricky. If only Shulk was here. We're dead meat without the Monado! Get away from him! No, you guys are working well together. The Monado, kid. More space between Zanza and us, the better. If Ryan's got time to sound off, we must be doing okay. We are doing okay. Ryan is correct. Perhaps we rely too much on the Monado and Shook. This is probably true. Right. We've chosen to fight the Bionis. We have to manage on our own. Let's go. <laughs> Look at them struggle. <laughs> if they can't even handle a few Telethia, how do they expect to do They are handling a few Telethia. Rude. This is not the end. Dude's doing it left handed. Like, come on. No, keep your guard up. Work together. 
I just overdid it. Fiora. <laughs> I'm okay. You don't look fun. okay. Why are you bothering to try and cover it up? Go on, just admit you've had enough. Never. Look out! Bloods of dino beasts. Come on. We can do it. It truly seems as though everything is going as Sansa planned. Don't say that. But our hearts okay. and minds, they still hold the will to seize our own. You are very stubborn, so yeah. Being stubborn no is very good in this point. You try to break us. The future is ours to shape, Dixon. They choose how they go out if they have to go out, but you have no future. Face it. Your destiny is to die here. No. I refuse. Yay! Ooh. That was awesome. Thank goodness you're here. Damn kid. So you're still alive. We are still alive. Attack. Destroy what are you going to do? Shoot me again? Come on. That was a cheap blow. What? That was awesome. <laughs> It was awesome. Shulk. Welcome back. Okay, do we have time to be chatting? What's he gonna done now? Do we have time to be chatting? Time for me to get my hands dirty. Shulk, look out! Huh? Oi, kid. It's about time. For your final lesson. Smack him. Show me what you've got. You think you've got the power to oppose Lord Zadza? Yes. Let's see how you do against me. Oh, good. I can kill you. All right. Now we got to use Shulk for this. No. Yes. Okay. We got to use Shulk for this just because, uh, yes. Dumban. Dumban needs revenge here. Let's try this, because this is personal. Oh, we already have a chain attack. Yes. Uh, I'm not really in the best position, but... Oh, I can't... I didn't get break on it. Uh. Oh, well. This is fine. Come on. We're working on it. Come on. Do, 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 do. Let's. Okay, perfect. Eh, keep it just for a little bit. Okay, come on. Uh, why are we so discouraged? Oh, come on. Oh, rude. Come on. Oh, we're dazed. Uh, come on, let's encourage each other here. Come on, we got this. We're fine. We're fine. We got this. Come on. No! We're fine. We're fine. We're fine. Why are we dazed? Okay. Come on. Okay. Come on. I didn't mean to heal myself. Uh, okay. But if we can... Do a chain attack, I can... Heal her as well. Okay. Okay. 
Okay. That works. That works for now. We're fine. Come on. I probably should have had Charla, but this again is personal. Uh Oh. Come on. No. Why are we all Okay. Come on, Minato. Nice. Ooh! We do it. That brat. How could he read my movements? What the hell's going on? Ha 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 ha. Shulk! How'd you do it? <laughs> I could see it. The future. I don't have the Monado, but it came to me, Ryan. From within. Nice one! Looks like we're back in business. <laughs> Bunch of ingrates. You're just a sore loser. Come on! Stop hiding and get yourself out here. I don't appreciate being left to do all the hard work. Alvis! What? It can't be. Alvis! Not you too. Yeah. Another one of Lord Zanza's faithful. One of the Trinity. I knew it. I knew he was the one. But is he f turning on it? No. How can he be one of them? Alvis. Is this the only reason you served under my family? You traitor! Oi! Say something! Shulk! Leave it. It doesn't matter what he is. Stab him. That doesn't change anything at all. Stop. Does it? Alvis. Yes, precisely. You must find your own path to the future. The Telethia, he's... So you're just another one of Sansa's lapdogs. Get ready, everyone. Where is he helping? No mercy. As you wish, let us see that will to survive. Oh, I didn't get to change characters? Oh. Rude. Yes, a chain attack would be very good. Alright. Come on. I didn't do as much as I wanted. Nice. Look to bleed. All right. Okay, come on, side attack. Okay, let's move. Okay. Come on. Oh, I was saving it, and now it's a good time to use it. No. Okay. Come on. Ah! Oh. That all you got? Not so tough without your pet, are you? <laughs> I'll show you the will to survive. Ryan, stop! Ah! You dare not! <laughs> Meddling kids! Are you from Scooby Doo? I have seen your will to fight. It is time to decide. What do you say? Does this world belong to you? Or to Zanza. Well, <laughs> either way's good with me. But I wonder what Zanza would say about it. He desires the same, and he sees everything as you see, Shulk. It's like he says. Ah! Get back here! You understand. Don't you, Shulk? What is your end game? Oh! Yeah. You okay. Bet on it. We'll be waiting. Bet. 
I don't like how we'll he said bet. Behavior. And we will be the best guests you ever had. Ah, that's quite a good comeback. I'm impressed. <sighs> I'm trembling. Me. Stupid meddling kid. <laughs> After all these years, I never thought the day would come when I would feel fear. I'm after you. Very somber mood. Dunban, have you seen Fiora? I have. She said she was going out to get some air. I don't think she went far. Thanks. I'll take a look. Okay. <sighs> oh, no, no, no. Fiora, here you are. Oh, Shulk. What's wrong? Oh, it's nothing. Shulk, you can see the future. It's... Stop saying it's so peaceful! It's hard to believe that we defeated a horde of Telesia just minutes ago. <laughs> Sansa wants to finish us all. So we can make the vision he's had come true. If you say things are peaceful, We're things don't stay storm. peaceful. They'll be back, won't they? The Telethia. To remove us all from this world. I won't let that happen. Whatever the future holds, we can never give in. Not to Zanza. No, not even to our destiny. I wonder why Alvis said what he did. Which part? Does this world belong to us or to Zanza? Why would he side with Zanza? Power? Or maybe he wants to live forever. Who knows? Hmm. But I don't think his motives are that simple. I'm sure Alvis has some kind of plan. So I'll trust him. Otherwise, why would he speak to me in my dreams? He spoke to you in your dreams? That's another reason why I have to find Zanza. I have to find out why. You and me both. I must fulfill Maynath's wish. Hmm. Shulk? You wanted to speak to me about something. Oh, that's right. Lenarda's looking for you. She wants to examine you. She's back at Junks. Oh. Hey, um, can you go ahead? I'll go and see Lenarda in a minute. I need a few minutes to myself. Okay, no problem. <laughs> Shulk, you can see the future, but you're Thank so you. dense sometimes. What can I do? If I go to see Leonardo, she'll find out what's happening to my body. I need to come up with a good excuse. Or maybe she could then help you. Oh, please, let me be with Shulk just a little oh. bit longer. We better have a happy end. I'm gonna have to flip tables. Zanza is inside the Bionis. I just know it. Dixon must be there as well. <sighs> yes. And Alvis too. I should go to so bed soon. How get to them? <laughs> if they're inside the Bionis, we're gonna need to dig a pretty big hole. How long it take? I'm we pretty sure out? the sword already it did the job. Happens, I have the answer. On the Bionis chest is a massive hole that leads inside. <laughs> right? I was gonna say. <laughs> it's the wound made by Agil's final attack. Then that means. Yes. While the Allied force keeps the Telethia busy. You can sneak inside that wound and take out Zanza. Oof. We will take junks. Let my father know when you are ready to depart. Yeah, time to knock some heads. Ricky knows. For Ricky family, Ricky win. We must show this right. god our unyielding will to survive. I'm so ready. My people will not be in vain. The crimes against our friends will not go unpunished. Shulk. <laughs> 
Ready. <laughs> Guys, we just like... Chest. We will free our no more lockouts. Good. I mean, we're in the last chapter, so... I love it's like, ah, for my people, for my family. Shock! I don't even know where to start for what this these two chapters were with just chaos. We're into chapter 17. I was just going to do chapter 15, but I could not end on chapter 15. That was not going to happen. I'm just absolutely emotionally exhausted after this. It was amazing, though. Nothing better happened to Fiora. We better find a way to, to help her with that body. And it better not give out. I will be flipping tables. I, I cannot handle this. I cannot handle more heartbreak. Every time I'm like, oh, we have this little bit of happiness. They just rip it away and smash it. Like, ah, oh, finally, Eggle has come to his senses. And now he's dead. But not from us. Zanza was not who I thought he was. I'm still not quite sure why Shulk is outside, you know, the realm of fate. Possibly because he got intertangled with Zanza. I'm not sure what Alvis's end goal is. I'm... The only thing I do know is that I really, really, really want to smack Hulk Hogan from Wish. I don't want to say his name. Dixon. He needs smacked with the Monado or a replica Monado or I don't know, but this dude's got to go. Anyways, this has been a ton of fun, even if it did rip my heart out and just smack me around the entire time. All right, my beautiful beans and things, you know what time it is. It is time to read some comments. But as a small aside, before we read comments, I am sorry if my voice is really off today or if there's anything wonky in my editing last week or this week because I have been sick, quite sick for the past week. And whatever virus has wrought havoc upon my immune system is refusing to fully relinquish me from its grasp. With that out of the way, let's jump into our first comment, which is by Fluffy Evie. Caffey Line doesn't trust Dixon for the entire game. Dixon betrays the party. Caffey Line, surprised Pikachu face. You can absolutely expect someone to betray you and then still be shocked and horrified by their means of betrayal. I thought, oh, maybe he's just trying to, you know, manipulate Shulk for his own purposes to get revenge on the Makanas for some strange vendetta. Or maybe he wants to steal the Monado's power for himself. You know... Some normal betrayal like that, not, hey, this kid I've been helping his entire life after rescuing him, I'm going to shoot him through the heart, straight out murder him, and then resurrect a god. That falls a little bit outside of the normal spectrum of what people think of as betrayal. But uh, hey, that's what makes Xenoblade fun, so I'm not going to complain too much. Anyways, thank you so much for your comment. Our next comment is by Aero Novara. Going on how this game is foreshadowing things so well. Remember back at the start of the game, right after Colony 9 was attacked when Ryan and Shulk were discussing what to do next? And Shulk quickly says that he wants to get revenge when he says that there are two versions of himself arguing in his head. One saying not to stoop to that level and the other scream to make them pay. Well, as it turns out, it wasn't Ryan's voice in there like the game joked. It was real. That was Zenzo's voice this entire time. And also sort of in correlation, I want to read out this comment by Goose Thomason regarding the foreshadowing when Ryan points out the Makanis when they're on the shin, Shulk says, yes, air enemy. Thank you to you guys and everyone else who pointed out these little bits of foreshadowing because this game excels at foreshadowing. It is fantastic how they do it. Even just these small little details in snippets of dialogue, things that could just be passed off of oh yeah he's angry he wants revenge but he's trying to be a good person but he's like ah no i'm gonna get revenge anyways is really actually a great bit of foreshadowing and also air enemy i mean he could be referring to ryan as well but really he's referring to him and zanza just unknowingly. I'm sure there are a ton of other little details like this that I've missed. So yes, please keep these kind of comments coming. I love them. I love getting my mind absolutely blown by these tiny little details that seem insignificant, but really just add to the depth of this game. So thank you both for those comments. Sadly, that is going to have to be it for today. So have a good day.
Have a good night, wherever and whenever you are, and I'll see you all soon. 